Happening right now, a mother is searching for an EMT worker who saved her daughter's life after a serious car crash on Riverside Drive back on Easter Sunday. Our morning reporter Wanye Reese spoke with the mom and joins us live from outside of the hospital emergency room in Macon. Wanye. Good morning, Carly. Not all superheroes wear capes, and that's especially true in this story today. I spoke to a mother, Henley Wilder, and she says that a mystery EMT worker saved her daughter's life. And for that heroic act, her heart is filled with gratitude, and she just wants to say thank you. Jay Marie Wilder is your typical toddler. Very joyful, very lively, very energetic, outgoing baby. Her mom, Henley Wilder, is the proud mother of the two-year-old, but Easter Sunday, any parent's worst nightmare came true. And I got a phone call from my mom at work saying that my baby had been in a car wreck and knocked unconscious, but I had no clue how bad it actually was. The injury to little Jay Wilder was extensive. Her neck was broken and her spine was injured. After the accident, Wilder says an off-duty EMT worker saw the wreck and jumped into action. She pulled her out of the car and she did CPR on her and got her back breathing. And if it wasn't for that, she could have been dead or brain dead. She, she literally saved her life. Jay Wilder is now in intense rehab in Atlanta, but her mom is still searching for the person who saved her daughter. We checked with the Bibb County Fire Department and the Bibb County Sheriff's Office. We also checked with the EMTs here at the Medical Center at Navicent Health, but Megan Allen with Navicent said none of the EMTs from this hospital responded to that accident. So Wilder, she has this message to whoever saved her little girl. I am so, so thankful for her. I really feel like I owe her the world, which I can't give her, but I want her to get some recognition for being the angel that she was. She literally saved my baby's life. My baby wouldn't be here right now or either would be brain dead if, if it wasn't for what she did. Wilder says her daughter is improving day by day, but says the EMT who saved her daughter gave her a second chance at life. Wilder told me that faith, family and friends, that's what's been getting her through this tragedy, honestly, that happened to her daughter. And Carly Wilder also told me that since the accident has happened, she's been here at the hospital, she's been up at the rehab facility by her daughter's side every day, watching her get better day by day. Live in Macon, Wanye Reese, 13 WMAZ News. So glad that she's improving. Thank you, Wanye. Wilder says her daughter is now learning how to walk and talk again. They're expecting to bring her back home to Macon next month. Matt, I really hope that we can update this story with a reunion between the mother and that EMT worker. If you are watching, please come forward because I know that she would love to give you a big hug. Yes.